Distance is a fundamental stellar property. Without knowing distance, it's impossible to measure the luminosity or absolute brightness of a star. And so without measuring distance, it's impossible to know the true nature of a star seen in the sky whose flux is measured, whether it's a giant star, a main sequence star, or a dwarf. Parallax is difficult to measure from the ground. Typical image sizes from ground-based observatories are about an arc second or a fraction of an arc second. Image positions can be measured to about a tenth of that. And so that only allows the possibility of measuring parallaxes of a few tenths of an arc second, which limits us to distances of a few parsecs, the nearest dozen or so stars. From space, the image sizes go down by a factor of 10 or 20 to 0.1 arc second or 0.05 arc seconds. The position accuracies can be measured 10 times better than that, to a hundredth of an arc second or less, which opens up a distance range of 100 parsecs. There are 25,000 stars within 100 parsecs. In 1989, ESA launched the Hipparchus satellite, which used a highly elliptical orbit and several years of observations to directly measure the parallax of 100,000 stars. Thus, we have the distances of a large stellar population sample within a few hundred light years of the Sun.